Good morning, dogs. Captain Gallon Moore after the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Seniors, if you have not yet received your cap and gown, please stop by student services and talk with your counselor. The theater department will be presenting Guys and Dolls on April 24th, 26th, and the 27th. The doors open at 6.30 and the show starts at 7. Tickets are $5 for students and $10 for adults. Come out and support. We've worked so hard on the show. Frito-Lay has a, has a summer job opportunity coming up on April 30th. The session will start at 10 to 10.30. Also freshmen, there's a learning to lead info session tomorrow. The meeting will start at 2.15 to 2.45. Sign up for both of these in student services. Now to sports and weather. Yo, thank you, Makora, and good morning, dogs. The Hot Dog Gophers travel to Crawfordsville Country Club to compete in the South Montgomery Invitational, knowing the team title was not possible. The dogs only had three golfers available to compete on this cold and windy morning, with Dylan Garrison with 97, Harrison Kiger with 98, and Gary Birch with 108, carry the blue and white proudly, knowing the team score was impossible. The Tri-West won Invitational with a 328, followed by Denver with 345, Crawfordsville with 365, and Northmont with 374, South Montgomery and Founding Central with 377s. Coaches McKinsey and Kelly, while disappointed by not fielding a full team, feel the team will be competitive and reminder of, and the remainder of the season and contender at the final Sagamore Conference match later this season. This week, the Dogs host a very good Timpton team on Tuesday, Northmont on Wednesday, Crawfordsville and Tri-West on Thursday, but other than that, the Frankfurt closes out the week on Saturday at the prestigious Kent, France and UN invite in Lebanon. Now sadly, the girls softball team is still looking for their first win of the season after five games. They suffered a rough 16-1 defeat at the hands of the Denver Warriors on Saturday. The girls saw, saw five different players step up on the record at least one hit. One of them was Macy Craig, who scored a run while going one for two. Also, the varsity baseball team got a solid 10-4 win over Danvo and with a 7-4 overall, and 3-2 in the second more conference and with Oscar Lopez earns the win with four strong innings of relief. Now the Lady Hot Dogs tennis team traveled to Tri-West and got a great 4-1 victory. Outstanding performances came from Libby Pierce and two doubles from Dallas Garcia Martinez and Joseph Figueroa finishing in the two quick sets. Olivia Fry and Emma Wilder both got comeback wins in the third set. First conference match, first conference win. Nice job ladies. But the girls will go against Mr. Boone here at home starting at 5, so make sure to come out and support. Well, that's all I have to report for sports, and now I'm going to send it to Birch with weather. Hey, thanks Brian. Diving into today's weather forecast, walking into school, I'm sure you all felt the nippiness in your fingertips, ears, and even your nose because it was a chilly 36 degrees. Over at today, expect to see some partly cloudy skies and winds ranging from 5 to 10 miles an hour for the majority of the day. It appears to be that the high is going to peak around 4 to 6 p.m., clocking it at a tolerable 62 degrees. But turning things towards sundown, temperatures will manage to fall all the way back down to the low 50s. It's going to be a little chilly, so time to bring out the hoodies and long sleeves again. Wrapping up my app session, I'm going to try to put in a good word to the man upstairs to bring us some better weather in the future. Now, back to your hosts. For lunch today in lines 1 and 2, it will be chicken alfredo. In lines 3, it will be barbecue rib patty, and finally you will be having pull apart pizza in line four. Special happy birth birthday goes out to no one. There's no birthdays. That's all for the announcements today. Have a great day, hot dogs.